Buddy, how's everybody doing today? I'm a little tired. Could I hope? A little tired. Oh, yeah. Today. A little punchy. That's, Not in a bad way, just tired. That's any day. I'm just fucking really? exhausted. I'm good. Yeah, I'm good usually. Yeah. I'm just tired. I'm trying to fucking work out again. It's just... Yeah. Ugh. Christ, getting back into it is a nightmare. Yeah, that'll do it. Well, I took the summer off because of the kid, and uh, I did a lot of cardio and biking and stuff. But, you know, lifting those weights at our age, fuck, man, getting back into it. Jesus, what's up with our joints? What the hell is this <laughs> joint shit about? You got to do it a lot and consistently. You know, get it. But what happens? Uh, we lose the juice in our joints? I guess the juice goes away. <laughs> is that what it is? The joint and, juice. And now it's just rubbing or something? It's just like... And we're not even that old. I mean, fuck, but... Yeah, that's that's it. Shit's starting to break down. Mm, could be, you know... Could be worse. I know. Steve could, Jobs. Could I guess Steve least, Jobs. <laughs> I guess it leads to Steve Jobs. <laughs> By the way, uh, I, I like pointing out that there's no God... I think yeah. there might be something, but I don't think man has uh, defined it yet. Yeah. Sorry, people, but I really just don't. You got a guy that is like one of the most important human beings to live in a long fucking time, has changed how we look at the world, and God goes, yeah, eh, I'm going to take you away now. Well, 56 he years. He needed him up there. He needed him up there. I okay. hate the people that are romanticized. And we just heard one on, and if you hear this, please call us uh, on MSNBC to like, well, I guess he's up there uh, designing something with Walt Disney. Ew. Disney. They what, said that he on blacks out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. uh, <laughs> I hate that. Stop romanticizing death. Uh, <laughs> you all got to face it, but Jesus, let's not uh, make it so romantic. Yeah. Is there any way to avoid pancreatic cancer? Like, is there, th like, oh, if you do this, you probably wouldn't get it? I really is, it is that just total genetics? Dude, I think that's pretty genetic. Yeah, that's horrifying. If it's just luck of the draw. Like you can't avoid it. And you can't. Get I it. Uh, I I had horrendous acid reflux about a year ago, so I was getting everything fucking checked out, every organ. And when it was uh, pancreas day, I I stopped breathing because any uh, other organ, if there's something going on, there's there's a lot of things, you know. But that's like a that's a death sentence. Why can't they just throw a new one in? <laughs> they can't do it yet. I know, they can't figure that one out. Because Steve Jobs, what? He had a liver transplant, right? Yeah, in like 2009, they put his new liver in him. And... But that pancreas will fucking knock you, knock you out of the game. Knock it, you for a loop. But Ann was uh, making the point, he had it for eight years, which which means he had some, he had some health care. Yeah, that fucking shit is uh, a death sentence, pretty much. Uh, but you know something? It was worth what they say, eight point three billion dollars. Yeah, uh, that'll get you some pretty good uh, health care. Yeah, he got some uh, shit that you and I do not get when we go to the doctor. Yeah, a lot of people with the same diagnosis, they don't quite carry on as long as he did. Mm -mm. Uh, uh, I'll tell you, a, a state-run uh, health care uh, uh, provider, I don't, th I don't think he'd do as well. No, <laughs> as having billions of dollars to spend. Uh, on on your health, so fifty six is not old, man. That's nothing in this day. I mean, we got William Shatner coming in at eighty one, and he's still doing it. Yeah, he could have been, you know, or eighty, whatever he is. Who he's knows? At least 80, right? Who knows what he would have come up with next? Ooh, mm -hmm. maybe an iPhone five. <laughs> <laughs> uh, a but, lot of people disappointed at that whole thing. But. Are they stupid four S? Yeah, a lot of people are disappointed. But then I was reading. Guys, uh, you know uh, why it's called 4S, right? Why? For Steve. For Steve. For Steve. Yes. <laughs> the For S me. represents Steve. For oh, Steve. Isn't that nice? Uh, they, uh, they, they were saying, though, like, hey, uh, uh, we never said there was going to be an iPhone 5. <laughs> they were like, eh, we never said it, really. A lot of people speculated, but uh, we said there was going to be an iOS 5. You know what? You this, know, an operating system. You're describing yourself perfectly right now. Yeah. <laughs> you're bitching that there's not an iPhone 5, and the world is mourning the death of a genius. And you're I, like, well, fuck his death. Where's my iPhone 5? Where's my iPhone 5? Actually, uh, Bobby <laughs> Kelly was going off on that, which is yeah. quite funny. He's like, yeah, Steve Jobs is dead, huh? So any news on that iPhone 5? <laughs> like, yeah, really? Uh, but it's not a surprise, which is uh, the thing. You know, everybody kind of knew he was going. 
when he retired a couple of months back. We said it. But yeah, a lot of people we were said here that. going like, uh-oh. He's only have a, I, I think we said he only has a few months left You said he'll be, he'll, be, he'll be dead within a year. And I thought you were wrong. I thought Really? I, not because I, even though he was very sick, I'm like, he's probably just uh, going to uh, let someone else do it to get them accustomed. But you were right. No, man. He, he looked like the type of guy that would work right up until his... Yeah. Uh, yeah. Until his last day. He looked horrible in that picture. That last fucking photo. Oh, he was, that was just a terrible oh, wreck. Where the, where the scumbags took his picture outside his home. Yeah. He it, didn't even look like he ever did, you know? Like, you look at his young pictures, you could not tell that that was the same person. I, I, he just, yeah, I guess that shit just eats you up. Mm -hmm. he, he, was, he went through his, like, chubby phase. And then... Uh, and he went through his I'm I'm fucking withering away phase. But then in what? 2005 Wonderful. he claimed that he pretty much beat it, right? It was cancer free, I think. Cancer free. Yeah. He was, he did that uh famous speech at a college. Yeah. And uh talking about how death changes uh when you're looking at death how it changes you. And you think differently. You go for the gusto. Yes. So yes. you have nothing to lose. Cancer free doesn't mean anything. It's like you're cancer free, but then you're not. <laughs> yeah, you fucking sucks. You're only cancer free until you're not. <laughs> yeah, that's why I want. That's why I want Obama again. I want all money going into fucking stem cells. I'm telling you, this type of shit should be fixable. Yeah, and I don't want it. Be, but oh boy, you said Obama. Yeah, no, nah, but I mean, he's the guy that's going to go for. Oh he's going to keep. I don't care about the rest of the stuff. This type of shit is ridiculous. <laughs> I want. I want anybody in there that would be you know for stem cell I agree, research. Yeah, anybody. I mean, Obama can't get anything done. Fucking stem cells, you know. He's in office. Where are they? I got them to melt them. They melt me some stem cells. Did you get oh, really? some stem cells? Like, yeah, Jim. Love those so you're just staring at him going, so yeah. I don't know what to do with There's these There's a things. pile of infant carcasses I had to get them myself. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Pluck them out. <laughs> you had to try to figure it out yourself. Imagine. <laughs> Here's your stem cells. Yeah. Yeah. This should help with your flu. <laughs> right. Well, Steve Jobs, everyone's talking about it today. That's Man, oh, I mean, yeah, they were all over the news, uh, you know, sucking his dick. He had a long haul, Which, though. Uh, you know, good. He deserves it. Yeah. But he had a long haul. Well, he was always a uh, very motivated guy. It's just it. He was always in the shit. But he really hit big in what? 84, they're saying? Uh, 84. No, no, no. Uh, well, 84 was the famous Super Bowl commercial. Yeah, that's the one. And I guess they gave him the boot in maybe 86. Yeah. And then they brought him back. Uh, 90. Yeah, ninety. I want to say six. Ninety. I thought ninety. I want to say ninety-eight. We're just blurting uh, years out. It doesn't matter. It does. <laughs> no. They fired him. They brought him back. He saved the company and uh, gave a bunch of. Um, well, the point I was trying to make. Gave us a bunch of fun things. Only in the last uh, what seven to eight years is when the whole fucking thing exploded for him. Hmm. I'm talking about his pancreas. Well, yeah. I, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? 97. Oh, yeah. And then all of a sudden, everything just exploded. Yeah. It all came together for, the, for uh, Apple. Yeah. The, uh, the And and oddly enough, uh, it wasn't really the computer that did it. It was that goddamn iPod. When that iPod came out, people were just like, whoa, this is great. And, uh, and then the computer's followed people started going like oh well apple what mm -hmm. they're still around mm -hmm. um because i mean you know windows based computers uh mm. just huge pcs right huge you forget. It, it looked like apple was done you forget right and then uh what did that pc was do wrong you think after the ipod because they tried their stupid soon. Yeah, soon. Soon. they just couldn't get oh. it together uh, as far as Apple was so much more uh, intuitive and user friendly. It was just sleek. Yeah, you know what I mean. It was just looked easy cool. to use and looked cool. Yeah, Apple. Apple uh, was more for the individual and uh, and uh, anything Windows based was corporate man. Well, shit. Yeah, look at these computers outside our studio. When you have to jump on that real fast, you're like, oh my god. One of those. Yeah, I, I, I keep a few around the house. The windows? Yeah, every so often you need them. Got yeah. shit going on. Still use them for video games. Because, uh, yeah. <clears throat> Apple, not so much. Not so much for that? Yeah. Mm. And so I make myself feel good every so often playing a video game on a PC. Because uh, I actually am able to uh, play it well. Instead of with a console controller. You still can't like do the console. Fucking <laughs> tard that I am. 
Oh, boy, could I shoot around everybody. I'm the best at shooting around anyone that's running at me really? with a machine gun, and uh, they just wax me. To work a controller, Suck. you need um, hand karate. I call it hand karate. Hand karate. You know, like you, you have to move your fingers in ways you've never moved them before. I just can't zero my fucking target in. I can't zero that reticle in to fucking fire on somebody, especially when they're moving. Yeah. It, I'm like, well, oh, there it is. Too far left. Up too far right. Up the if I could get that reticle on the fucking target, I'm amazing. Right. And I could do it with a mouse and keyboard. Right. Uh, it's, it's second nature. You know, you, you're never using your computer and go, fuck, uh, I keep missing the link. I can't click it. I keep going over it and then over it again, and I'm clicking and I'm missing the link. It's, it's second nature to you to be able to zero right in, click, you're done. But that's your problem because a 12-year-old could do it like it's nothing. Exactly. Oh, Uncle Paul. So what is it? You think it's the juice leaving our joints? It's, the, it's some of the juice leaving the joints. Uh, I don't know. It's yeah. fucked up. Uh, Silly Goose, would you rather take your chances with pancreatic cancer or drug-resistant AIDS? Jesus Christ. That's a horrible question. you got to well, go with the AIDS, though. Getting the AIDS is a lot more fun. <laughs> yeah, no. A lot more fun, and uh, it, it, it takes you have a story. <laughs> <laughs> it takes a good solid 10 years before everything starts kicking in, right? Well, or something that's like true that. Too. you got a little uh, time before you even start feeling anything. Then again, pancreatic cancer you can't give to somebody else. We lost a good uh, friend. yeah. We lost a good friend of the show uh, to the pancreatic cancer. Really healthy fucking guy within a year dead. Good old Doctor Filatov from the WNEW days. You kidding? Diamond Vision, remember him? Yeah. Yes. He did all our eyes? Yeah. Did the peepers? He did all our eyes. He did a million of them in my family, and uh, and certainly uh, a lot of listeners got their eyes done from Doctor Filatov. Yeah. One day, got the call that he was gone. I'm like, I didn't even know he was sick. Yeah, shit creeps up on you. Mm. Yeah, that's some bad shit. What else on uh, Steve Jobs? Steve Jobs' death is a publicity stunt, really. Oh, uh, really? He's that's still alive? In. People are uh, at the Apple Store, I guess. They're going to the Apple Store in Manhattan and uh, leaving flowers Why? and lit candles and Macintosh apples. In tribute. What assholes. People, people, <laughs> people are starving just, and they're leaving apples on 50, uh, Fifth uh, Avenue because uh, a guy died? Uh, yeah. People Dummies. are just weird, man. Uh, people, just weird. People really need this connection yes. thing. And, and it's just the dumb. Whenever I see a roadside memorial, I want to fucking crash my car into it. Yeah, why? why? Just, I, I hate the roadside of memorial. because it bums everyone else out. I'm sorry for your loss, but I don't want to be bummed out while I'm driving to it, Philly. Bums you out. It's like, how about this one? I, there, there's a in my neighborhood. There's a, a turn that I guess a tree fell mm -hmm. just out of nowhere. A fucking huge branch fell and killed somebody. It's close to your house? Yeah, yeah. This is a while ago. Okay. Um, was this part of the hurricane thing? No, this is years ago. Okay, okay. When I make that turn, still to this day, there's the tree stump because they had cut the tree down where the branch fell. And killed the person. There's a tree stump, and there's flowers and a cross nailed to it. It's like, isn't the person in a fucking cemetery? Don't decorate your goddamn neighborhood up like a fucking cemetery. It's depressing. For the love of God. Yeah, we avoid cemeteries to begin with. Yeah, what am I going to do? So why don't you fucking leave a, skip through there? Leave a sign that just says, enough already. <laughs> enough already. Right. Move on. <laughs> Move along. Nothing to see here. This is one of those uh, in Huntington. We're just outside of town with teddy bears and pictures. Oh. And the pictures are in plastic. and uh, That's look, great. It's horrible for the family. I'm not even going to fucking try to make a joke about it. Yeah. It's horrible, but it's depressing for everybody. What what purpose is that serving? Society. Society. Like, society. Look at that. A cross nailed to a telephone pole with flowers. Just Jim moving. Brown. What? Really? We should... Uh, we should run for office and make make that our goal to get rid of all make that. Make it illegal. Make it illegal. Oh, God. Imagine the, out, <laughs> the outcry and outrage you'd get from... I guess people have to do this type of thing, I guess. You know? And then what, do they also go to the cemetery? Look, my... my you know, my dad fucking died on the road. We don't have... We don't have shit out there. No. We just don't have shit out there. We don't want to bum everyone else you out. You got a place. Oh, God. What is that? Jesus Christ. They got fucking... A wreath on a sign. Obviously, he was on a motorcycle and rammed into that sign. Mm -hmm. Jiminy yep. Cricket. Then a, a huge piece of cardboard with two, four, six huge pictures. Yeah. 
Then you got, what else? What is that thing? And they're not even done well. I mean, if you're going to do something, <laughs> you know, make a mold, make a mold out of plywood and pour some concrete and build yourself like a monument. <laughs> but they're, like... they're horrible cardboard with bad printed out <laughs> pictures that end up faded from the sun or running from the rain. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry they didn't take an art class uh, after their yeah. son was killed. It's a death Horrific collage. Way. I love driving past your death collage. <laughs> Did you notice that the plants are in uh, tire pot uh, planters? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's motorcycle tires laying there, and they well, filled them with dirt and put some flowers well, in there. Why not go with a decoupage? A decoupage? A decoupage would last. Get out there with your glue gun. and. I think a decoupage would last through the winter. Isn't that shellacked? Yeah, that's wood? what I'm saying. Yeah. Let's decoupage. That'll do it. Stupid decoupage. Did you guys decoupage growing up? Oh, never. It's kind no. of a cool word to say, decoupage. I talked to the first, and, I, and we didn't have to fight. I was like, look, Page. <laughs> 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 don't Fuck make it. me. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't like the uh, roadside but memorial. Definitely not. getting back to today, so they're leaving shit at the Apple stores? Yeah, they're, now they're leaving little their little tributes over there. I'm sure if you went down to the Apple store, you'd see that. Uh, flowers and 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 stuff, and I'm sure I'm sure Steve Jobs is very uh, thankful, mm -hmm. you know, that that happened. He doesn't know, he's in a freezer somewhere. Well, you never know, Aunt. Who what? are you to say? I don't. Maybe think so. he does know. I don't think that's he does. what people tell me all the time. Maybe he does. Maybe he does know. Steve Jobs is everywhere. Don't you just hate how they want to be married to it? Though you're right, they want to just be connected and connected married to the treasure. Some way. People's is that right by the Apple Store today? Huh? Your flowers. Well, if you're gonna if you're gonna leave flowers, let's leave some fucking flowers. There's, I guess that was early on. Oh, okay. Because there's only four out front there. Yeah. Yeah. Paper mache. Yeah. No, you can't do paper mache. That no. shit will get all uh, really ah, uh, that's soft in the rain. Soft. For, That'll break down, it. man. But not not a good decoupage. Now with eight. Uh... Eight billion dollars in in worth. Eight point three. Let's not yeah. blow off the point three because the point three any point of us three. can live off. Oh my God! <laughs> what is point three? Is that three hundred million? That's three hundred million. So let's not blow Just off the, the point three. Let's not blow off the point three. No, we shouldn't blow off the point three. <laughs> Eight point three. I'll take the point three billion dollars. Uh, what do you think he does? Does he does he pull a, a Ted Williams? Does he pull a a, a Disney? Disney was a rumor. He's not really frozen. If I was lucky enough to be worth eight point three, yeah, I would insist that it's piled up into a big, huge, just a huge pile and and burned at my wake. Wow, <laughs> that would be selfish. <laughs> How great would that be? That would be a good one. Just as burn a, me in it like a Viking. As my family is just kind of, you know. Looking on, going, ah, <laughs> right. ah, waiting for an ember to blow a hundred up that's still good, right. so you can grab just, it. Just losing their minds. Uh, <laughs> has there uh, been any uh, I would assume, talk of plans? Uh, is he going to freeze himself? Is he going to cremate? Uh, I, well, I would assume a couple things, Anthony. If yeah. if he survived pancreatic cancer for eight years, I would assume first of all they're chopping off his head right now to yeah. freeze it. Mm -hmm. Got to freeze the Steve Jobs uh, head because he has that type you. of money. It's a head you gotta freeze. Gotta freeze the Steve Jobs head, and I would assume most of his money would go to charity. Why freeze the head though? Because yeah. by the time he came back, if they figured it out, computers would have passed him anyway. So like, if he came back in fifteen years, oh, he'd be an idiot. We'd be like, shut up, because <laughs> he'd be saying you? things like, "We're going to revolute." What do you want? We, we just we just snap, and there's music playing in our ears because right. yeah. <laughs> everything's moving so quickly. I, I hope some of these head people get to come back. It'd be hilarious to see yeah. them walking around town. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I've I've heard tell that the uh, frozen head thing really doesn't. Uh, yeah, they really are going to have to come up with some very cool technology to fix that because. Um, really? Uh, yeah. Well, yeah. Because you have to count on like some. Some kid to keep everything uh, running properly. And, and running properly, and and from they forget, what I hear, and the, the air conditioner goes off for a weekend and fucks up everything. Yeah, and, and actually, from what I hear, even if this stuff works properly, your head just kind of fucking like falls apart in there. It's just, uh, it's not, it's not like they'd pull your pristine head out that looked like it did uh, when you died, right? And uh, you know, stitch it on someone's body or something. I think they're they're trying to like save the brain or some cells from the brain, and so in some way they can. You know, maybe clone it. I don't know. He said, well, you know, we don't have to freeze his whole body. We can freeze his head. <laughs> yeah.
Yeah. <laughs> Ted Williams. Ted Williams, that's right. Ted Williams. He head. said, well, you know, we don't have to freeze his whole body. We can freeze his head. Can you imagine you go, all right, man, you know, this person in my family was so important. We're going to do this. And then you got to watch as they're sawing your fucking loved you think one's they head the, off. You think they let the family in for that procedure? <laughs> I don't know. Let's sit around and watch as they chop his fucking head off. Right. I don't think so. But, uh, yeah, that, uh, well. uh, Oh, someone, they're showing Twitter, said someone wrote, R.I.P. Steve Jobs, I said. Oh. I said. Oh, I said. Yeah, they're doing I said, and everyone's doing <clears throat> the Was that a pen Oswald? Uh, no. somebody, he said, yes. He said, uh, rest in peace, Steve Jobs, closest thing we had to Tony Stark. I, I'm, I'm not sure what that reference is. Who's Tony Stark? Iron Man. Oh, no. Iron Man. Okay. Iron Man. Oh, duh. Oh, yeah. Jesus. I was thinking of like course. kind of a Edison kind of a thing. Yeah, he's a thinker. He's our someone Edison. That, uh, yeah, he's like our Thomas Edison kind and of a guy. everyone making the iCloud uh, joke out there today. Everyone. Oh, really? Yes, he's in the iCloud or the iClouds or the fucking... Wow, okay. Uh, more about roads, roadside uh, memorials. We got uh, Mike, who used to be a cop. Mike? Mikey! What's up, guys? Hey, man. Hey, I used to work on a, a major road in New Jersey, and uh, when there was a fatal, there was a lot of fatal accidents, so they used to put the roadside memorials up, and people used to, you throw a looky lose that would drive by and then get another accident looking at it. Yeah. So there weren't a lot out there, so we would just rip them out. So you'd see a family put it there. Drive by the next loop, come back, throw it in the trunk of the car, and throw it in the dumpster. Um, so we just had dumpsters full of uh, road, these roadside memorials. So these people put it out there thinking it was going to be there forever, and uh, it was about 15 minutes. <laughs> then why do some last, man? You see, you see one, you see uh, one here and there on the yeah. LIE or the Northern State Parkway. Yeah. Going local for the people it's their here. Policy. Yeah. Certain, certain roads you'll never see them on. Right. Uh, yeah. You know. But uh, yes, some of them let, let them be out there, but uh, we never did. Mm. Hate them. Yeah, I, I understand your mourning, but that that just bums everyone out. A know? white bicycle? Did you ever see that one? I saw that. My ex used to live in Brooklyn, and uh, on the corner there was a, a spray painted pure white bicycle. It was okay. a memorial for someone who got. Uh, uh, all right, hit. what does that mean? Because I saw one in a different place. It, the, it must the, mean they were killed on a bike there. The cut through. Uh, if you're cutting through Central Park. In your car, obviously, yeah. to get to the east side. There is a white bicycle. Just It's been there for years. Really? So does that mean someone was killed there? I'm thinking. I could be wrong, but I mean. And I've always wondered, why has this bike survived? Why didn't uh, the city just take it away? Huh. They're called ghost bikes. Really? Yeah. Fuck, They're I didn't somber, know this. Yeah, somber memorials for bicyclists who are killed or hit on the street. Oh, no, there's nothing to laugh at, Daniel. <laughs> I once have heard the tingling of a bell, and it was a ghost bike. <laughs> Nobody else heard it. We're getting a lot of quick info today. Ghost bikes. We're getting a lot of quick info today. Oh, isn't it amazing? It's like flawless. A uh, ghost bike. I did not know that. Ghosts. I had no idea. <laughs> yeah, there's one uh, in the Central Park cut through. Ghost ride the bike. <laughs> the ghost, ghost ride the whip. <laughs> Remember that trend? Yeah. I think we lost a few during that whole thing. Dummies running themselves over. <laughs> uh, uh, a ghost ride the whip memorial. <laughs> yeah, dunce. Oh, God. All right, well. Yeah, whatever. Steve, Steve Jobs, Jobs. dead. He changed their lives, blah, blah, blah. Music in our pocket, blah, blah, blah. Steve Jobs, dead. Like when they do that on the news. At the age of 56. Uh, 56. And then we have to we have to look at the black screen for 15 seconds. For, oh, they put a picture on with the, you know, born and died date and yeah. just silence. Yeah. And then the, uh, goes to a fucking loud yelling guy. $500! Yeah. <laughs> I'll give you $500! What happened? It was a memorial. I, I always uh, found oh, that, you prick. I always found that funny, too, man. <laughs> what? What are you doing? Uh, it doesn't work unless you have a good follow-up commercial. But they have to dramatically have somber. that black screen for a few seconds. Yeah. 